I'm saving now so we don't have to look at Lava Zone again. Even though we're going to have to fucking go through it for a fourth time. But we'll get into that when we get into that. So, Starlight Zone. Did you miss this being a Sonic game? Because so did fucking I, my god. No, not, not save, not save, not. Don't save on the game over. That would be catastrophic. So, of course, a big gimmick here is these hide. Oh, wait, I think. If you go far enough to one side, it re it despawns. Does. Dun, 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 dun. But yeah, big thing about this stage is you can actually go fast. God, did I really did miss being able to go quick in this game. Labyrinth Zone is genuinely exhausting, holy fuck. Yeah, that was very ready to shoot me. I am getting very lucky with these not hitting me. Noting just how infamous this game kind of is. So yeah, obviously this isn't the fastest speed stage. Like, frankly, fucking Hydrocity was faster and that was a fucking war stage. Come on. There we go, a bit of momentum. That's one thing I do find annoying about momentum based platforming. It's that when you have no momentum, it's very tedious to build it up. Fine, I'll go down the shit chute. There we go. No? Okay, I thought it would... Oh, it just sends me to a lower section of the level, fair enough. There we go. And now we have enough rings for a special stage. And we're gonna miss the ring. <laughs> losing it. Oh. <laughs> okay, but yeah. I'm not gonna do save states until we're actually on one life again. The save states are back up so I don't have to spend ages doing, you know, playing the game. Because, like, you know, as... As helpful as they are, they're not really fun to use. Like, that's the main reason why I don't really enjoy ROM hacks, because, like, you know, they're just... They are mad difficult, but not in a fun way, in the way that you have to reset every five seconds. That could have been very bad. That also could have been very bad. But yeah, I just love this. Right, we're doing the save state as a backup. There we go.
And here's some real momentum from a Sonic game. Nah, no, but you know what though. This is like a really nice stage, just aesthetically and musically. I didn't actually need jump there. There we go. And there we go. Uh, yeah, let's... Let's get on that upper path. Okay, we're gonna get one up just from Fucking again I did not think the stage was going to end that early we were It's literally just a minute Well, we need the backup anyway. <laughs> We've lost. We've only gotten two special stage rings in this entire playthrough. And I've managed to cock up jumping into both of them. Well, at least now my, when I complain about it, I'm actually going to have footage for it. Okay. Yeah, that thing wants to shoot me in my arsehole. Right, yeah, that's trying to suck me away from it. It's an interesting gimmick. So yeah, go slow down to get on there. Yeah, don't really care, just... Invulnerable. And I go away to do this. Fair, fair. There we go, and now that guy can actually launch me. Gameplay. And I know that if I actually jumped before, I would have made it on the upper path. And probably got more rings out of it. Not that that matters, because this is Act 3. Okay. That's the thing. Capture, can you not glitch on the thing? No, bad. Oh, I literally... No, right, that's for the upper part. Yeah, fair enough. Game. Don't really care that much. Or like at all. Well, at least it is a somewhat simple boss. Well, I say that, but like. I'm cocking up the timings immensely. Okay, let's... Let's stop being a failure. There we go. And I'm gonna die. Yeah, I literally killed myself there. I launched that into my own head. Me's are gonna save. Okay, fuck it. Let's go on this path. 
Hopefully we can get that extra life. That was intentional. No, it wasn't. <laughs> but yeah, if people are... But yeah, of course, this is old school difficulty where most of the gameplay padding was from difficulty because as you saw from there, if you do epic gamer tricks, you end up skipping half the fucking stage. But of course, I wasn't good enough to do... I wound up fucking up the game of tricks, so... Gotta love the spin physics in this game now. Well, the game... Well, the game itself isn't really designed too quickly. It definitely does give you opportunity to get speed in an otherwise slow game. And this game is... And this level is definitely designed for that fact. And then of course another little aspect with this game is... Wow, the graphics... Well, the designs of the areas get a lot more mechanical as you get further into the game. I am just being a right cock up, aren't I? Don't answer that. I'm just gonna damage boost. There we go. I've got one ring at least. I think having one hit is a lot better than nothing. <laughs> Also, once again, no rings at the checkpoint. What the fuck game? It's like you're trying to get people to restart from the beginning to pad yourself out. There we go, fucking timing. Okay, gotta get that ring. Fucking, this is quite the tricky boss, at least in terms of the physics. So, at least it does employ some game design principles of, you know, maybe have something from before that you build upon within the boss fight. Or, you know, tutorialize the mechanic inside of the stage. Okay, genuinely, can I build up a little bit of a speed? There we go, fucking... Nope, he went to... Yeah, why wasn't I doing that more often? You bitch. I swear, I'm just gonna time out at this point. How many hits did I even do? There we go. Can't be dead. And we're free from that boss fight. Nice. 